At Michigan Tech, we're just so well set up to continue developing autonomy. We're on the cutting edge of technology in multiple different fields. That be the computer science, mechanical, electrical engineering. All the different branches sort of come together to make autonomy function. So it's really cool that we have all that capability here. And we're just so uniquely positioned, especially for marine autonomy, being right on the Great Lakes. With the autonomous jet ski, it's myself and Travis White are the leads on this project. So him and I are working together to continue to develop autonomy here at the GLRC, and in particular marine autonomy, an area that's a little bit overlooked compared to the automation of vehicles and aircraft, things like that. So we're hoping that we can get the marine sector caught up in that area. This technology could be used for things like uh, life-saving measures, oil spill response, a variety of things like that. We're working to establish the Smart Ships Coalition with the Office of the Great Lakes. In the Midwest region, we're the only dedicated test site for this sort of technology. We're very well equipped to handle testing, support testing, so not just for ourselves, but for other private industry partners or potential other university partners. Michigan Tech is recognized as a leader in this field. There's not a lot of regulation right now with autonomous systems on the water, so that's something we're uh, in close contact with the Coast Guard, different governing bodies, Office of the Great Lakes. So all these different government entities, we're seeing what we can do to work with them and sort of develop this policy so that everyone can have a good idea of what's gonna be required moving forward. We're really open to working with others to make sure that we can all move forward together.